Okay, today I'm gonna to show you a few techniques with washing windows with an extension pole. So first I wanna go over the general concepts and what I'm doing when I use the extension pole. So let's say I, let's say this, this piece of glass is higher, okay? So you'll get it wet with your, with your applicator and then with a, an extension pole, you know, you can't really do, you know, the S technique, right? So what we'll do is we'll, we'll put the squeegee on a little angle like this and cut straight across to cut all the water along the edge. It's the same concept that if I pull straight down, I'm gonna drag about an inch of water. Or if I kinda come across on an angle, it makes a perfect line. It cuts the water completely off the glass. And if you cut it right across the top here, you're gonna, you're gonna cut all the water down away. Whatever's higher as you pull down, your water's gonna escape out. So it doesn't matter if you do this way or this way, it's gonna escape. So let me show you a, an example of that. So let's say I angle down, all my water's coming out here. Now if I come down and do it the opposite way, my water's gonna escape out and leave this line. So as you're working your way across a piece of glass with the extension pole, you come across and over and then down. Across and over and down. Across, over and down. And that way you're not getting any water here or any water here. So as I normally wash in two people, I have one guy go ahead and scrub. Um, so, so your scrubbing technique, you don't, you don't want to do that because then you get all your water on your ledge and it's going to run down on you. So what I do is I run my scrubber straight across the top, in the middle, across the top. So scrubber on, so same concept as before. Cut the top and down. Cut the top and down. And I'm coming down on an angle that it's escaping off that left side. So that line of water, once I get to, to the, the point that it's only one more squeegee swipe to get it cleaned off, my towel down here, I'll dry that squeegee blade. I leave about three inches from the edge and then cut across and then down. That way I'm cutting all that water across the top and there's nothing dragging down. So that window's completely perfect. Once you get to an elongated piece of glass like this one, from here to here, I'll actually use a little bit different technique. It's the same concept, but I'll start all the way over here, I'll come all the way over, and down. And then I'll do one more to catch that water, and then one more here. Oh, I messed up. And finish it off like that. I'll dry the squeegee. Come here. That la this last piece of glass, this last piece of glass here, that technique, you don't have to do it. You can still come down, 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 and then finish it off. But for me, it's a lot faster just to come across a couple times and then down.